This is the west entrance to St. Mary's Hospital, the main lobby entrance here at St. Mary's. And the way it's arranged is that you can drive up and drop off a patient there if you have to and continue on around and then you can park your car right in this underground parking ramp. It's called Mary Bry Underground. If it's full, you can come out the other end and continue down the road to the Generos parking and that'll be just near the ER. Now all of these buildings are connected underground, so once you get to a parking spot, you can go down to the subway system, which is a system of underground walkways. So you can get to where you need to go without going outside. Also, when you get to the entrance, you might want to peek at the beautiful stained glass at the top of St. Mary's entrance. It's, it's wonderful stained glass. It's like a rainbow sort of motif. And also down the way a little bit is a clump of trees that you can't quite see is a wonderful peace garden, a place where you can sit and think and spend a little quiet time. Now we're in the main lobby of St. Mary's Hospital, and I want to tell you about a few things while we're here. Behind me is the information booth, and that's where you can check in for admissions, and also if you have any questions, they can answer them for you there. You can also start a self-guided tour of St. Mary's Hospital if you have time and would like to do so. You can start that at the information booth. On the left side of the information booth is the pharmacy, so if you need to pick up any medications, you can do so right there. And down the hallway next to the information booth is the way you get to the cafeteria as well as the chapel. You can follow the signs along the way. The chapel's really lovely and it might be a fun place to stop in and visit if you have some time. The chapel that's attached to St. Mary's Hospital is so lovely, I thought I'd bring you in here to show it to you. Now, the nuns made sure that a chapel's been part of St. Mary's since the 1880s, and materials from all over the world have been used in building this place. There's a beautiful marble altar up there, lovely stained glass. All people are welcome to come in here and spend some quiet time, meditation, prayer. And if you can't get up here, it is shown in patient rooms on a certain channel. So if you want to tune in, you can do so.